we're going to do a meditation um, around abundance. Now, I am very drawn to um, really share this space with a goddess called Goddess Lakshmi. She is a Hindu goddess, and some of you may have heard of her um, before. So she's the goddess of wealth. She's the goddess of fortune, power, beauty, fertility, prosperity. Um, and she transforms dreams into reality. So she's the perfect creation. She is self-sustaining, she's self-contained, um, and she's all about nature. And um, she is a Maya. She's the delightful delusion, um, the dreamlike expression of divinity that makes life comprehensible, hence worth living. And what I've been doing this morning already is I've been, um, I did a scan on the group because, um, for, you know, quantum, there is no time and space in the quantum world. And I knew that the right people would show up for this meditation. And um, I put into the coaching app onto the Healy um, a focus which says, um, I am worthy of what I desire. I surrender to the wisdom of the universe and I am open to receiving unexpected opportunities. Something that's really important is that we are worthy, we feel worthy of receiving. We cannot receive unless we feel like we are worth it. So this is something and, um, that I would like to bring in to the space today. And um, we have a few scans that came up. I'll just briefly go through them before we start. So the first one that came up, um, was um, the basics of self-esteem, which is about um, standing in the center of my own existence and I'm aware of it. I realize and develop psychological well-being. I am active and live in personal responsibility. Then we went into career, resolving stress factors. So I recognize and harmonize and transform what causes me stress in my job and work mental hyperactivity without practical inflammation. So that's all about bringing practical aspects to our careers, our life mission. Um, we're then gonna look at finances, identify focus. I experience the power to understand and implement the following focus for my benefit and the benefit of the whole, spiritual wealth. Okay, so whatever spiritual wealth means to you, we're going to be bringing that into our, um, into our field today. We're then going to be resolving any motivational disorders. So anyone that's struggling with motivation, um, this is going to be harmonizing um, around, um, the disorder of, I believe um, that others don't trust me. So this is about switching that around and knowing that others trust you with what you're doing. Um, spirituality came up next, which is I live my spirituality. My higher self loves me. Very important that we connect with our higher self. And finally, I grow into my perfect wholeness by developing and harmonizing my personal quality of unselfishness, okay? That's what came up on the scan. I've added another one, which is um, a, a mantra, which we're gonna be chanting today. So we're gonna be chanting the mantra of, um, of Lakshmi, which is for receiving um, whatever it is that we would desire into our fields. Um, and the, the mantra, what it means is, Goddess Lakshmi lives inside my heart and gives me all abundance I need in my existence. Okay, so as we are chanting this um, mantra today, um, that's what it means. So it's all about just reconnecting with our heart space and knowing that everything we have is already here already. We already embody it. And just, this is a reminder to then just to relax and to allow all of everything just to flow towards you and towards us in this meditation. So what we're going to do is I'm going to put on a mantra, which is um, about attracting abundance, like I said before. And um, it may take a moment for you to get the mantra, but don't worry too much. I recommend just we're going to put you on mute and just be singing it or, sh or, or chanting this mantra. and. Uh, it's going to be, um, one second. I've got the correct window in front of me. There we go. So 
It's a beautiful mantra for abundance and wealth. We're going to repeat it for 108 repetitions. Um, that's very important for this for us to receive. And don't worry too much about what the words are, but just speak whatever comes out and just follow the mantra as best you can. Once the mantra has ended, we will go into silence uh, for quite some minutes, okay? So just allow all of that mantra just to be embodied and to feel the frequency that you've created inside. Um, at the same time, I'm vibrating. And uh, when, when we're finished, you will hear the uh, chime. And then you will know that we have ended the meditation for today. Um, before we get started, are there any questions? No? Okay, fantastic. All right, make sure everyone is muted. Okay, and just now just closing your eyes, wherever you are, laying down or sitting, and just focusing on the breath for a moment. Connecting with your self-worth, your worthiness, your power, your beauty. And just allowing yourself to ground and when the mantra starts, we can begin.
Now allowing to go into silence, bringing gratitude in, feeling grateful for all. All that is all that we already have.
And now imagining we're all together in the same room. You put out both of your hands and we're now holding each other's hands in a circle. All of us together, feeling the presence of each other. Everyone who is here experiencing this and visualizing Lakshmi also in our circle, holding our hands as she is spreading her energy, not only material wealth, but also spiritual wealth. Abundance in all forms flowing now around a circle through our hands, flowing around. Firstly, anti-clockwise, and feeling the presence of each other. You may even feel the frequencies of each other's fields running through our hands right now and the frequencies that are running from the Healy. Sensing the power and flow and beauty. Now letting go of the connection spiritually, bringing your hands to your heart and bringing that energy into your heart space, allowing that frequency to flow within your heart, to open your heart, to receive, and to be grateful for all we are. Maybe just having a small smile, letting the corners of your lips, and as you smile, bring that energy of smiling into your body to end your day or start your day. Take a deep breath in and breathe out. Whenever you're ready, you can come back into the Zoom room. The edita meditation is now completed. <laughs> Remember, Lakshmi is always here with us, always. And even if you don't follow Hinduism or any of the goddesses, her energy is so powerful and if any time you feel like you're in lack of something or something is not coming to you, just remember to connect with your heart space. Lakshmi is always there. You can find this mantra on YouTube so you can easily, if you feel like going into it, um, you may have found there's some resistance when you're chanting the same thing over and over, but often that is the block that we're facing to not receive what it is that we're worthy of. So if you ever feel like that kind of resistance with the mantras, Remember, you have to break through it to be able to receive it. So just a reminder. Um, so um, I'm not going to open up the space to share because this meditation is a short one. But um, I would love to, um, if you'd like to um, share something in the Telegram group, or if you'd like, you can share something in the chat now, just briefly, if you want to. Otherwise, I'll leave you to your day um, and we can connect on another time. Hopefully see you next Sunday for the next meditation. All right, lots of love everybody.